Namaste everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm Madhura Bhagwat and today is day four of Arm Balance series. We will be flowing through a vinyasa flow sequence which is specifically designed for Kaundanyasan. This is an arm balance which also requires a bead of twists and working with the hamstrings and hips. So without further ado, let's get started. Let's start by coming onto our fours just to warm up our wrists. Turning both your palms towards the sides, gently begin to move from right to left. Taking deep and breaths and out. Then slowly start to draw circles, moving from your right to left. And slowly turning the other way around. Inhaling and exhaling here. Then coming into your neutral position, this time you turn both your palms around so that your biceps are turned forward. You take a deep breath in, slowly begin to drop your abdomen to lift your chest and chin. Exhaling to curl into your spine, chin to your chest. Inhale. Exhale out. Inhale here. Deep breath out. Inhale, coming back to neutral position. Exhale, lower your hip towards the back. Slowly coming back to center, gently reposition your hands. Now taking your left knee towards the center, straighten out your right leg and keep pressing your heel towards the back. Inhale and exhale. Inhale, you draw back to center. Now this time you lift your right leg up, bending into your knee, gently cross your right knee on top of the left and press your hip towards the back. And from here, you walk further back so that both your knees are stacked one on top of the other. Now, if this becomes uncomfortable, you can always use a block and sit on a block instead. That height makes it more accessible. From there, you take your right hand on top, left hand under, and you clasp your fingers. Gomukhasan, cow face pose. Deep breaths here, inhale and exhale. Now inhale, you take your right hand on top. Then you draw your left foot next to your right knee so that your left knee is turned up towards the ceiling. An option to hug your knee from the outside with your right hand or you take your right tricep onto the other side for a twist. Digging deep and breaths and out here. Inhale, slowly release. Starting to walk your palms forward, you reposition your legs. Inhale, you lift up your right leg. And as you exhale, you draw your knee to nose. Inhale, back. Exhaling, knee to nose. One more time, inhale. Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale to lift back and exhale, gently release. Let's do the same thing onto the other side. So this time you straighten out your left and keep pressing your heel towards the back. Then inhale, drawing back to neutral position, begin to float your left leg, bending into your knee, you cross your left knee on top of the right to gently press back. Now slowly begin to place your hip down so that both your knees are stacked one on top of the other. This time you take your left hand on top, right hand under, 
to clasp your fingers. Feel free to use a strap to hold onto if you're unable to reach or you could hold your own t-shirt. Taking deep in breaths and out. Then inhale, you release your left hand on top, releasing your right hand. You take your right knee next to your left. Inhale, take a deep breath in. Exhale, you twist to the right. Focusing on inhales and exhales. Then slowly turning your gaze forward, gently release. You walk your hands forward, placing your right knee down, straighten out the left. Take a deep breath in, flexing your foot. Exhale, point your toes, knee to nose. Inhaling to press back. Exhaling, knee to nose. Inhale to press back. Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, you press back. One last time, exhale, knee to nose. Inhale to lift and exhale to release. Gently drop your hips from side to side just to relax yourself a little. And now tucking your toes under, lifting the knees to press back into your first downward facing dog. Feel free to bend one knee at a time to move your hips from side to side as you inhale and exhale. On your next inhale, you start to find stillness in your down dog. Keep actively pressing away from the mat. And then gently lifting high up onto your toes. Make sure you're properly gripping onto your mat. Start to tiptoe forward. Keeping approximately a foot distance from top of the mat. Inhale, you lengthen your spine. Exhaling to fold. One more time. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale to fold. Micro bending into your knees, chin to your chest, curling into your spine, starting to roll yourself up. Drawing your hands at your heart center, take a deep inhale. And deep breath out. Inhale, circling your hands over your head. Exhale, twisting to your right. Inhale to center. Exhale to your left. Inhaling to center. Exhale to fold forward and down. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, step back and plank. Now this time you drop your knees down for support. And then bending your elbows towards the back, four times we lower down and press up. So exhale down, inhale to press, exhale to lower. So you want to make sure that when you're pressing up, you're not just simply going down, but you're transferring your weight forward to lower. And up, forward and down, and up. Exhale, chest and chin down, and this time lifting up in Cobra Bhujangasan. Exhale, downward facing dog. Take a deep breath in and deep breath out. On your next inhale, onto your toes to gently turn your gaze forward, bending into your knees. And step, hop, jump forward. Inhale, you lengthen. Deep breath out to fold. 
Inhale, lifting your hands over your head. Exhale, twist to your right. Inhale to center. Exhale to your left. Inhaling to center. Exhale to fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, step back in plank. Now you have the option of lowering down knee chest chin or this time transferring your weight forward. Bend your elbows towards the back to lower. Chaturanga. And now lie down onto your belly, interlock your fingers towards the back, drawing your shoulders down, shoulder blades in towards each other. Inhale, begin to lift. Focusing on deep and breaths and out. And slowly lower. Tucking your toes under, inhale, you press up and back, down dog. Take a deep breath in. And deep breath out. Inhale onto your toes, gently turning your gaze forward, bend your knees, step up, jump forward. Inhale, you London. Exhaling to fold. Inhale to circle your hands over your head. Exhale, twist to your right. Inhaling to center. Exhale to your left. Inhale, you lift up. And exhale to fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Option to step back, lower down, or, or this time you begin to bend into your knee to hop back. Inhaling to Cobra or Up Dog. Option to go into Down Dog or you lower down in plank to press up and back. Take a deep breath in. And deep breath out. On your next inhale onto your toes to turn your gaze forward. Bend your knees and this time you want to step, hop, jump through to come to seated. And then bending into your knees, hands forward. You take a deep breath in, exhale, low boot. Inhaling to lift up. So work on curling into your spine slightly to draw those knees in. Exhale to lower. Inhale up. Exhale. Inhale to lift. Exhaling to lower. Let's do some more. Inhale up. Exhale down. Inhale to lift. Exhale to lower. Last one. Inhale. Exhale down. Now stay here and this time lift your right leg up. Twist your right. As if you're holding a block in between your palms. And left. To right, to left. Let's go some more. Inhale, exhale. Right, left. To right and left. Let's go last time. Right and left. Inhale, you come back to center. Hold that three, two, and this time, bend into your knees, step your feet down. Open your knees with or without your hand support to meet me in chair. Take a deep breath in. And deep breath out. Inhale here. Exhale to fold. Inhaling to lengthen. Exhale, step up, jump back. Inhale to Cobra or Up Dog. 
Stay breath out, dumb dog. On your next inhale, right leg goes up. Exhale, right knee to left tricep. So cross the body. Inhaling to lift up. Exhale to cross. Let's go again. Inhale to lift. Exhale to cross. Then straighten out the leg, drop the foot down. Inhale, lift your left hand up. Then circling your palm down. Inhale, right leg lifts. Exhale, step your right foot forward. Inhale, high lunge. Deep breath out. Take a deep breath in. Exhale, drawing your left triceps onto the other side of your right thigh. Twisted high lunge. Focusing on deep and breaths and out. Open your hands wide. Inhale, lift the twist and gently reverse the twist. From there, reach towards the side. Your left palm lowers, begin to float, twisted half moon. Focusing on inhales and exhales. Then micro bending into your knee, circling your hand to lift up and twist towards the left. But this time you're bending into your knee. So taking your right palm on the outside of your left thigh, you twist. Slowly begin to draw a circle, this time stepping your left foot towards the back at 45 degrees angle, placing your left palm in line with your left shoulder or taking it onto the other side. Twisted triangle. Focusing on your breaths. Now slowly circle your palms down, repositioning your palms. Step back, down dog. Take a deep inhale. And deep breath out. On your next inhale, you wave forward into a plank to lower down, knee, chest, chin, or low plank. Inhaling to cobra up dog. Exhaling to down dog. Inhale here, and exhale. This time drawing your right foot towards the center, inhale, left leg lifts. Exhale, left knee to right triceps. Inhaling to press up, exhaling to cross. One more time, inhale. Exhaling to cross. And then straighten out the leg. Inhale, right hand lifts. Then slowly circling your palm down. Inhale, three legged down dog. Exhale, gently step the foot forward to rise up, high lunge. Inhale, hands at your heart center. Exhale, slowly twist to your right, sorry, to your left. Drawing your right tricep on the outside of your left thigh. Inhale, open your hands wide.
and from there you begin to lift the twist and reverse the twist, lean back. Slowly reaching towards the side, your right palm lowers begin to float, twisted half moon. Focusing on deep and breaths and out. Then micro bending into your knees, inhale slowly, circle your hands to twist towards your towards your right. From here you again circle and this time you step your right foot at 45 degrees angle taking your right palm down either in line with your shoulder or onto the other side. Twisted triangle. Keep drawing your left hip back, right hip forward to lengthen and twist. Then slowly circle both your palms down and this time drawing your palms in neutral position, gently step back, down dog. On your next inhale, right leg lifts. Exhale, you step your right foot on the outside of your right palm to come into lizard. Dropping your knee down, turn the sole out, placing your elbows down or you could stay up on your palms. The idea is to keep drawing your pelvic down towards the mat as much as you can, of course. Inhale, slowly begin to lift. Now, you draw your right foot towards the center and from here, tuck your left toes in right hand lifts, twisted runner's lunge. Now from there, inhale you again lift the twist and to reverse. And this time, as you go into your twisted high lunge, you start to cross so you draw your left knee down towards the mat to come into your seated twist. So again, you could always sit on a block if that's more convenient to you. Now placing your palms down in Chaturanga arms, preparing for Count Dinyasan, you begin to lift your hip up. And then transfer your weight forward and then slowly begin to straighten out the leg. Now, I don't have space at the back, but you basically want to work on straightening out the legs. Three, two, and one. Slowly sit back. Taking deep in breaths and out. Then gently unfold, step back, down dog. Let's repeat the same thing onto the other side to balance out the body. So inhale, step your left foot on the outside of your left palm. Then gently dropping your knee down, turn the sole out to go down onto your elbows and breathe. And from there, very gently begin to lift up. Drawing your left foot in neutral position, tuck your right toes under, lift the knee, and lift your left hand up. Twisted runner's lunge. From there, slowly begin to lift the twist, 
And then gently lean back, reverse the twist. Taking your right tricep onto the other side of your right thigh, this time coming into twisted high lunge. And now turning your gaze down very gently, drop your right knee on the outside of your left foot. Focusing on deep in breaths and out here. And once you're okay here and wish to go further into your arm balance, this time you place your palms down. And then lifting your hip, transferring your weight forward, slowly begin to float. Straightening out the legs. Three, two, and one. Slowly sit down. So I'll again turn the body. And now turning your gaze forward, slowly unfold to step back in down dog. On your next inhale, onto your toes, step up, jump through to come to seated. And then lying down onto your back, bending into your knees, you take your left ankle above your right knee, taking your hands or weaving your hands in between your legs, you interlock the fingers around your right shin bone. Take a deep breath in. Exhale, draw your left shin towards the chest. Beautiful. Inhale, slowly begin to release. And this time taking your hands in cactus position, keeping same leg position. Gently drop your knees towards your left, turning your gaze to your right. Inhale, you roll back to center, exhale, chain sides. So this time taking your right ankle above your left knee, interlacing your fingers around your left shin, draw your right shin towards the chest. Focusing on deep and breaths and out. Inhale, slowly begin to release, then cactusing your hands. Gently drop your knees to your right to turn your gaze to your left. Inhale, slowly rolling back to center. Gently hug your knees in towards the chest to draw circles with your knees, moving from right to left just to relax your lower back and hips. Moving from left to right. Turning your knees out, drawing circles. And the other way around. And once you're ready, slowly preparing for Shavasana. Keeping comfortable distance between your legs, hands by the side of your body, palms turned up towards the ceiling. Allowing your fingers to curl naturally, wiggling your shoulders away from the ears and breathe.
closing your eyes, drawing your awareness inwards and scanning through your body from your toes to the crown of the head. And little by little guiding each and every part of the body to relax itself completely. Now once you're ready, feel free to stay here a little longer or if you're ready to come out, gently start to wiggle your toes and fingers. Drawing your feet together, hands over your head, stretching out your extremities, take a deep breath in. And as you exhale, slowly turning onto your right side, make your way up onto the mat in any seated position. Keeping your spine upright, shoulders roll back, chest forward, palms at the heart center. Being grateful for today's practice, inhaling palms to your forehead, exhaling bow forward. Inhale gently, drawing yourself up, take a deep breath in and deep breath out. And once you're ready, slowly blink your eyes open. Thank you so very much for practicing with me today. If you've enjoyed this practice, leave your lovely comments in the section below. I genuinely enjoy reading them. And like this video and subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to check out the playlists in the description below. Thank you.